Hey everyone, today we've got a really awesome tutorial on how to turn goose shells into floating decoys. If you didn't know any better, you would think that's a floating goose decoy. Nope, it's dead! <laughs> nice! If you've ever wanted to use Canada goose decoys, you probably know that the floaters take up a lot of room. Decoy shells like this are much easier to transport and they're lighter and stackable. The only problem is they don't float. Today we're going to show you the most effective way of making Canada goose shells float. This method will give you lifelike motion and realistic poses. Is stick them on your head. Balancing the goose shell on your head can be a bit cumbersome. So if you really want to take your goose hat to the next level, there's a few tricks we're going to show you. Step one is to remove the headgear out of any old hard hat or welding helmet. Next, you're going to cut down dowel rods to use as attachment points for the goose shell. So we've got the support rods mounted to the headgear, but since hunting can put a lot of stress on your gear, you're going to want to reinforce those joints with some duct tape. Final steps are using screws to attach the support rods to the decoy shell. This adjustable string really adds a lot more stability to the goose hat. Goose hat, baby! 